what's going on guys in today's video we're going to talk about a topic that seems to be coming up more often these days and that is what are some ways that you can get yourself into help desk right so everybody knows getting into cybersecurity is kind of tough these days but one of the best ways that you can get into the next phase of it is to get into a help desk role first and then gradually work your way up whether you want to be in cybersecurity or digital forensics or networking whatever it may be the first step is just get yourself in the door and to do that a great path forward is help desk so what i want to do is just outline a few different things that you could be doing and projects that you could be working on to get yourself that first help desk role so that you are equipped to go into the field and do what a technical analyst does a good place to start is a site called try hack me they have an active directory course on there or a path that you could do and it's really going to give you some fundamentals of active directory i don't i mean everybody's different but the most places that i've been at they use active directory so this is a crucial skill that you want to really get down and know because you're going to need it regardless of what part of the industry you go into active directory is in layman terms a address book of all of your users your computers and it puts all of these users and computers into a organized way that allows you to deploy policies change passwords and do so many other things uh, so that's a good starting point Point, and a great site for that is try hacking the next place that you're going to want to look is Coursera Coursera is offering some great courses right now um, and a lot of them are fairly cheap or free to get you into the next phase of your career and one of them that I highly recommend is the tech support fundamentals and that's on Coursera Another place to start when you're trying to become a help desk analyst or a help desk technician is to know the operating system that you're gonna be troubleshooting, which in most part is gonna be Windows and Linux. Sometimes you'll deal with some Mac, but I do have a great course that I went out and found for you also on Coursera that's gonna really give you the base fundamentals for working with these operating systems. And the course is called Operating Systems NU becoming a power user. In the course, you're gonna see that there's a lot of different modules in there that are gonna give you both Windows and Linux experience and kind of show you how the file systems work, how the permissions work, um, the base fundamentals that you would need to get into a help desk role. This video is not even sponsored by Coursera. I just really do like their product. And I think that they have a lot of useful information out there for, like I said, very cheap, sometimes free. Um, so it's a good source for you guys to go on there and be able to learn at a low to no cost. Now, while you're working on these projects, I highly recommend that you're also getting a certification certifications are going to make you more valuable on your resume especially when you're coming into the industry with no experience it's something that shows that you have proven knowledge in a certain set of area and the two certifications that i really want to recommend to you and i think you should start off with are the comp tia a plus now there's two parts to that certification so get both of them and then after that do the CompTIA Network Plus and that's going to give you more network foundation on top of your A plus baseline fundamental knowledge. Now these certifications um, are typically a few hundred dollars and that is cheap in the world of certifications. Uh, I recommend that you save up for that because like I said, it looks great on your resume for somebody that's just trying to get into the field. Certifications are very important, um, especially for folks like you. So I would highly recommend doing that. So that kind of wraps up everything that I wanted to explain in this video. I hope I was able to give you guys some real good training modules slash projects that you could be working on uh, to just beef up your resume to increase the likelihood to landing a job in help desk, which like I said, is really the start into IT. And then you can move up and go, you know, the sky's the limit, go wherever you want to at that point. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you in the next video. I'll see you later.